I'm gonna find out who knew I was Sam Bennett's son and didn't tell me. Teresa is doing this for all the wrong reasons. She's making love to Ethan so that she can show him how much she loves him, how committed she is to him. Oh, and she thinks that he won't hate her once she tells him that she knew the truth about Chief Bennett being his real father and keeping it from him. Yeah, I mean, she's using sex to try to hold on to Ethan. She's just afraid that if Ethan knows that she's been lying to him this whole time, that she's afraid she's going to lose him. Hey, Ethan, man. You got to let this go. I mean, the truth will come out on its own sooner or later. Well, I'm not going to wait till later. Look, Chad, this is eating me up inside. And you, if anybody, should understand. Yeah, but you're so hot for payback. Suppose you go after the wrong person, you know? I mean, maybe somebody out there knew the truth and then kept it a secret from you because they didn't want to hurt you. Look, I don't buy it. I'm not proud of it, but I'm not going to rest easy until I hurt the person that hurt me. I mean, what does it matter now who did what when? <clears throat> you said yourself, man. Chief Bennett wasn't the monster that you thought he was, right? <clears throat> he saved my life. Well, that's exactly what I'm talking about, man. I mean... Time changes things. Hey, take a look at the cranes. I mean, there was a time where you used to think that they could do no wrong. Am I right? All right. That's my point. Yeah, but here's my point. You know, maybe if it was just me involved, I, you know, I could move on without looking back. But whoever did this did a hatchet job on my mother, too. No, I mean, I can take whatever life dishes out, but I'm not sure she can. It's not like she was ever in love with Julian, I mean, is it? That doesn't matter. She gave up the best years of her life for me, so I could have the world on a string. Now it's blown up in her face. She's probably going to wind up all alone. Dude, you don't know that. Oh, well, unless Sam Bennett does a complete turnaround and leaves his wife, I do. I've got to find out who did this to me. For my mother's sake, and for my own. That's him. It's a reporter who broke the story about me not being a crane. daylights another guy is not gonna solve anything huh, i don't care he knows you turned in the letter to the tabloid uh, fine fine go ahead give him another juicy headline for tomorrow's front page i swear to god Ethan, i thought you were smarter than that man all right so what do i do wait a second Slime ball is finished with his workout. You know what? I got an idea. Come on. Hey, don't I recognize you from somewhere? No, you. I don't think so. Sure? No, no, I recognize your face from... I got it, dude. You're that reporter guy who broke that, uh, that bombshell crane story a couple weeks back. Yeah, I thought I remember your picture from the byline, man. Yeah, that's me. Yeah. Yeah, I got a raise and a promotion out of it, too. Oh, congratulations, dude. Congratulations. Hey, just so you know, it's an honor, man. Thanks. Yeah, I mean, uh, I gotta tell you, that story was something else, man. You know, to be the guy to break the news that Ethan Crane wasn't really a crane, man? Ugh. I mean, you should be up for, uh, I don't know, some kind of award or something, you know? Thanks. Thanks. I don't know. I've always been curious about the cranes, you know? Just, uh, it's all the money and mystery, I guess, you know? Yeah, well, you know, uh, I actually consider myself somewhat of an expert on the family. Oh, yeah? No kidding. Yeah. Well, hey, man, why don't you, uh, I don't know, tell me some stuff about them, you know? I don't know. Something you found out, like, uh, some tidbits about, uh, I don't know, who they hang out with or, uh, I don't know, who just as soon see him fall off of the face of the earth or something like that, you know? I mean, it's obvious from the story that, uh, you know, somebody out there, well, doesn't like him. 
All right. Ask me a question about him. I'll tell you anything you want to know. Want to hear something funny? Just between you and me? <laughs> sure, dude. I didn't have to do Jack for that story. It was handed to me on a silver platter. Oh, yeah? <laughs> hey, buddy. Came in on an email. Everything I needed was right there on my office computer screen. Mm. All I did was print it out. The rest, tabloid history. Wow. So, uh, what happens with an email like that? Man? Yeah, it all depends. You know, in this case, I gave the original to Julian. Ten to one, he didn't hold on to it. And, uh, you know, I kept my own copy as a souvenir. Modern technology these days, <laughs> something else, man. I mean, email alone, you know? To be able to send something from, like, one computer to another computer in, like, a matter of seconds, that's, that's crazy, man. You know, don't ask me how they do it. I'm just glad they got the know-how. Yeah. Hey, let me ask you something, man. What if you, like, ever got a, an unsigned email, you know? I mean, how would you know where it came from? You know, like, you know, like, um... Oh, hey, yeah, like the one that your paper got about Ethan Crane's paternity. You know, I, if it was unsigned, how would you uh, know who sent it to you? You know, it's funny you mention that. Because I've been telling everybody who asked that there was no way to trace where that came from. See, but between uh, you, me, and the bedpost, I lied. No kidding. So, what, you mean you actually know the name of the person who tipped you off? I got their email address. It's just as good. All you gotta do is match up the address with the name of the internet subscriber. Yeah. Uh, you can do that? I mean, you can actually get somebody's name just by having their email address? Piece of cake. I mean, you know, not for me personally, but, yeah. you know, I, I know a lot of the names at the uh, big email providers. You know, it'll probably take me just one phone call to find out who sent the dirt on young Crane. Uh -huh. Or, uh, should I say... X-Crane, huh? <laughs> right, right, right. Yeah.